What's going on YouTube? It is Sunday, uh, getting out late. Came over to my cousin's house to hang out for a minute. I am actually, we about to go out and have margaritas and then we're gonna call it a night. But I um, said so I was gonna record something for you guys. So I will see you here shortly. Uh, I don't have much planned, but, but I'm gonna record a little bit in the restaurant, wherever we go. I didn't even wanna go out tonight, but we're gonna have a good time. So I will see y'all here in a minute. Monday didn't do much. Uh, didn't upload the vlog uh, from when was that? Was it last night. I think it was last night when I was record when I recorded with it. Um, yeah. You did last night, so uh, didn't do much today, so that's why I didn't really record. Uh, but I think I'm about to come along on the vlog from the car so i'm excited to get that to you guys that's coming up so soon and i think you guys are going to enjoy it so i hope you watch and um it's going to be pretty good um, a lot of pranks i'm just basically working on getting waivers because i want to protect myself just in case anybody says oh well, i didn't want to be on film i didn't want to be recorded well, I will have papers, waivers, to do the same. 
Um, and if not, those videos won't be on here for you guys to see. But I will release the ones, of course, that people agree to afterwards. So, um, that's about it as of right now. Um, I don't know. Might do something else tonight. So, I will see you guys probably in a little bit. Alright, so, watching the Cosby Show, an episode where Cousin Pam uh, came on came on to the show, and she's put her name on the food. So, me and Keisha were having a conversation on whether or not when you go, I guess, what? how would you, when you move somewhere, or when you stand, or a roommate with somebody, should you have to put your name on your food? I don't think you should have to, but then again, I guess, if somebody's not contributing, then yeah, and then you just bring all the food in, and they're eating your stuff, and not putting nothing in it, I guess that's wrong. What do you think? Um... I think in this situation, she might have brought a sandwich home with her or something. And, I mean, you know, they got a bunch of kids in that house. So, she wrote her name on it. I mean, I don't really see anything wrong with writing your name on food that you bring in the house. Especially if it's like takeout or something. Yeah. And I do understand if you're not contributing... To groceries that people feel some type of way about you writing your name on it. I mean, that makes sense. You can't write your name on, yeah. <laughs> on something somebody else bought. But I don't, know, I don't see a problem with that. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I think. Well, well, I don't know. I don't think you should have to do that. Especially, I mean, if you're a big, if it's a big family like that. Well, that's, I think he even, I think he told her that episode. That they don't have to do that because everything is everybody's in there. And it can be whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because well, what about if she don't have no money to eat? Uh, you run out of, you know what I'm saying? And now all of a sudden, now you're hungry, but you need that food. But now you was petty and wrote your name on all this stuff. It was like a sandwich that she brought home. No, it was all her food. No, so it was all her food. She was writing that. The, the sandwich was, was Olivia. She talking about, I, she said, I gotta have a sandwich. Should I put my name on? Oh, that's where I got that. Yeah, no. She's put her name on all her food that she's putting in her. I mean, but then from her, I mean, I don't know where she came from. She probably used to it. Yeah, too, maybe you know wherever I mean? she was living. Yeah. Because if you don't like, because then you have people too who will legit eat your stuff up. Like. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Like, it's theirs with no intentions of replacing it. Like, I'm going to eat your cake. Can you give me some cake? At all. Yes. You got some cake. I'm going to eat ice some of yours. Um. But, yeah, people will eat your stuff up with no intentions of replacing it. Yeah. So. I don't know. I'm trying to think when I had roommates in college. What? I mean, I don't think we had that problem, though, because... If we bought groceries together, we know we bought groceries together. Mm -hmm. If we didn't, we didn't bother each other's stuff. Yeah. Or unless if we, you know, if we didn't have a problem, we could be like, you know, I, I went to the store, y'all can have some. Like, we just kept communication open like that. Yeah. But, I mean, I've always been the kind, the type of person to respect other people's stuff. If I didn't buy it, I'm not going to touch it, basically. Mm -hmm. Without asking. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know. You guys tell me what you think. Should you or should you not write your name on your food? Um, in a multiple, I guess, living arrangement situation where it's multiple people in the house, should you have to write your name on your food or would you be willing to share it? I don't know. Tell me what you guys think below in the comments because I want to know. Because I guess it just depends on the situation. Um, but I think I'm going to end this vlog right here. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And it's like as, uh, and all, as always, I can't talk. Uh, leave your comments in the, in the bottom. A like, comment, and subscribe, please. And once you subscribe, you can also hit that bell to get notifications every time I upload. So... As always, thanks for watching West Terry doing TV and have a great night. Do you want to say good night? Good night. All right, see y'all.